Hi everyone, welcome back to the highlight channel. I have one implant full arch restoration today, and then it looks just same as uh, normal cases, but uh, has a little uh, special things underneath there. One big difference is we have only three implant, and then I got titanium bar to make it work this case. Let's see the details. For the bar design, I just uh, checking and try to make sure everything's on here. Um, Want to make the tapered bar, which is uh, we have one insertion path on top of the bar, so we can see the top margin area and the bottom margin. So we have just four degree tapered, and a three shape bar design has uh, the name is like primary bar, four degree tapered. I just use that, and we can see that where the implant screw hole is and try to make the flat and even occlusion, of course. Okay. And in the sculpting, we have function for under the smart toolkit, which can creating uh, the bar's bottom shape, which can match with the gum tissue like this. Okay. Easy and quick and accurate. Let's check the bridge design. Here. So after barge milling done, the fit was great. And then I did a surface uh, treatment. And then also I just let it grind out under the 11 and 12 area because uh, the implant uh, pushing a little uh, buckle out. So I just grind it out to creating a uh, more thickness. So T set up here first. And then also uh, the Pontic area, I just all cut that out. I don't want to make uh, the crown pontic touch that bar. So I want to make sure it and creating a gum tissue. So for this case, order setup is the same as uh, like uh, the denture without the denture module, which is uh, I set one crown on the seven and then all other teeth are pontic with gingiver. So that's why you can see small margin underneath of number seven. So after mill, you will not see I just tiny bit. So just after the gum and the tiss, and then when you get into the final lines, I have a attachment to creating a screw channel on the base of the implant. But as you can see, uh, if sometime screw hole cannot see well for that region, I import in the another scan, which is a show of the, the screw channel come up nicely. So I use again I use this function a lot. Additional scan function in here, right bottom. Okay, creating a hole and design is done. So let's see how the uh, the milling quality coming out. Titanium bar fit check. Super nice. Also, uh, milling is done uh, very nicely. As you can see, I have design like this. And then mill just same as the design. Outside, inside. Looks very nice. Okay, uh, just after the, all the pink porcelain and then stain and glaze work done. Just before cement, we have a three implant screw hole. Actually, for try to make, I try to make uh, number 11 and 12 as like a prep teeth style, which can make it like a separate crown on top of the prep teeth. But actually, screw hole channel position coming out on the pink porcelain. So I just uh, decide to just leave as a full contour crown. And then uh, doctors will cover with the pink resin for the delivery. So underneath, we have titanium bar, no shiny at all. After meals done, I just do the, uh, the sandblast for making a retention. Of course, underneath uh, at the bottom there is all the high polish it. So I'm gonna do cement, and I have final. So this highlight.